Hi, this is JP LaForce from Studio JPEG. In this video, I will show you how to upgrade the firmware of the Zoom H6 Handy Recorder. And in this particular video, I'll be upgrading to version 1.10. And basically what this new update does is it provides an update to the SD card test. And for me, it's not really a big thing, but it is going to test out to make sure that your SD card is working properly. And the other thing, which I find is really great, is the line out here, which you can use to connect to the mic input of your camera. You can now set the volume of the line out. Because in the past, the line out was too powerful and the camera mic uh, input uh, could not uh, receive the signal but with this new thing here there's no problem at all so the first thing you need to do is to copy the files over on your SD card so it's going to be the system file which is going to be needed to upgrade the Zoom H6 so you copy that over to your SD card and then the next step is you take the SD card you put it in your Zoom recorder and once the SD card is in, you have to make sure that you have fresh new batteries in the recorder because the last thing you want is to the, for the batteries to run out while you're upgrading the firmware, which could render your Zoom H6 into a brick, unfortunately. The Zoom H6 supposedly has a battery checker built in that checks and lets you know if the batteries don't have enough power. But I'd rather be safe and pop new batteries in. It's uh, four double A's are much cheaper than a new Zoom H6. And if you're going to be doing this by plugging in into the wall or a USB power or anything else, make sure that that power source is very stable. So if you're using uh, just the outlet. If your electricity goes off for any reason, uh, unfortunately, it could also break your Zoom H6. So once that you're ready to do the firmware upgrade, you're going to hold the power button and the play pause button at the same time. And then when it boots up, it's going to ask you if you want to upgrade from version 1 to version 1.10. So you're going to use the little wheel on the side. You're going to go on the yes. So, so it's going to be this little wheel here. And once the yes is selected, you click on the little scroll wheel. And it's going to tell you now updating, keep power on. And I'm going to fast forward this section because it takes a little bit of time. But probably shouldn't take more than a minute or two. So once it's finished, you get this screen here, which is a little darker. And it tells you that it's complete. And to press, please power off. So you power it off. So thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please leave them in the box below. If you like the video, please click like, subscribe, and share with a friend. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.